you ever had a chippy sauce, Mark? No. What is it? It's brown sauce and it vinegar mixed together. We have it in Scotland. My name is Mark Francis and I asked you to send in questions using the internet. So I'm rather interested to know what I've been asked. Curiously named Puddle asks, how do you cover up a... I'm not going to say that, but it's a nasty smell. And I'm not going to answer it because it's a vulgar question. Do I look as though I'm the sort of person who might have an answer for that? No. Janine asks, what is the one thing you can't live without? That's very, very easy to answer. It's a dimmer switch. Life is truly monstrous without one. And so are most people. Kep. That's an interesting name. Not a very interesting question, I'm afraid. What's your favorite from the chippy? Well, I'm not entirely sure. Chips, maybe? Ketchup or mayo? Yeah, both. Thanks. You ever had a chippy sauce, Mark? No. What is it? It's brown sauce and it vinegar mixed together. We have it in Scotland. You also have deep fried Mars bars in Scotland. I sense a trend. Olivia. How do you stay true to yourself in a world full of peer pressure? I don't believe in peer pressure. In fact, I don't believe in anything I don't like. I just ignore it. I block it out. I pretend it isn't there. And I think that is really the only way to live. What is something that has brought you comfort in 2020? I suppose it's rather comforting that people are still asking me questions and want to know my opinion on things. That's very reassuring. So thank you. Thank you. Haley. Favourite city break? Well, it depends on the season, it depends on my mood, it depends on who I'm with and what I want to do. If I want to go and buy antiques, I'll go to Paris or Rome. If I want to eat great food, I might go to Florence. If you want a beach, then I'd say Rio. Mm. What is the most extravagant gift you've ever received or given? I would say a letter. A letter where someone has poured out their heart I think that is the most extraordinary gift. The written word is quite meaningful, but of course it depends who's written to you. I mean, if I write to you, well, that is the most extravagant gift you'll ever receive. I can tell you that. Thank you all so much for these questions. It's been rather fascinating and um, an interesting insight into some of your lives. Thank you. Goodbye. <laughs>